Good morning guys, hope you're well. Random on Chain has asked me, how do you do a one-sided yield farm on Orca? Now, it's slightly different than Meteora, and I said I'll do a quick video on it just to demonstrate it. And he's also asked, how do you do a five or minus 5% all the way up to a thousand? So we're gonna show you that in the video. These kind of comments on Twitter or X, or if you comment on the video, help me know what content to make for you guys. So we're gonna demonstrate it very quickly on both sides. Now you might want to do a one-sided position, we'll get into why, but this is how it is. So you notice you can't do a customary one on a one-sided. So you've got two options. The first one is, this is the current price. If you want to do a one-sided Solana, you just go over to here and you type the price in. Now it's still greyed out, you might want to refresh it, and then we can see this line has come across. All we need to do is plus it, so it just goes above the white line. Now we can do a one-sided Solana position. So that's the one-sided Solana. Alternatively, you can drag and drop it here, and then you can just plus it or grab it along, and then you can do the one-sided position. Likewise, if we want to take the current price, and sometimes, because this is uh, Solana is jumping around a bit, you might want to click refresh, and this is the one-sided USDT. So this is if you think the price is going to fall, you can do the same. Now you want to minus it and you can do your position here and just deposit it. You'll have only Solana and it has to drop into range. Likewise with the Solana, it has to drop up above range. And the same thing applies. You can just drag and drop it across here like so and you can add your USDT or whatever token you added. This is an exceptionally good method if you want to do it on a meme coin. So if you want to do like, for example, you think a meme coin is going to drop it's a really really strong method to actually do so let's say useless you think it's going to fall you would go here and then you would say i want to just add 0 0.1 solana and then you would deposit it alternatively they have a ui where you can actually drag and drop so if you think okay the floor is i mean the useless chart is a bit weird but you might want to say okay the floor is here i want a range here and then over the course of a few months, I want it to just drag and drop and fly around here and then eventually shoot up, or you could eventually break even. Now, this is a 61% range. Likewise, if you really, really want, you think an, an old coin or a meme coin is gonna go really, really high, you could probably drag and drop this all the way up. Or you can say, okay, this is a thousand percent like random on chain asked. So that's a thousand percent. Yeah, so that's gonna go into the, well, that's gonna be a top coin if it does that. And then you'll just drag this all the way up and then you'll do a one-sided useless. So you think it's gonna moon. Now this is an exceptionally powerful method if you're early on something and you think it's gonna go up. But a thousand percent, highly unlikely. You're better off doing a smaller range and then working your way up. So you get a more concentrated amount of yield. And if you just wanna check how much the yield is before, because it doesn't show the estimated yield here. Just drag it out quickly and you'll see you're getting 33%. I'm currently farming useless as well. So useless is pretty good. I'm looking to build this pool up now of a, a, a smaller fee as well, because I think useless is gonna last for a while, hopefully. And then we'll see from there. So I hope this video has been helpful. I wish you all the best and take care.